gentle. Okay, why is the light going in and out? Okay, there we go. <laughs> yeah. I like to have options. That's why I like to pack everything. Oh, we're also gonna take an eyeliner. Let me tell y'all about my look. I woke up super duper early because we're about to go get my hair done. I got in the shower, washed and deep conditioned my hair. I gotta go blow dry it, but um, I haven't even washed my face or brushed my teeth yet. Cause yeah, so. <laughs> but um, before I even go blow dry my hair, let me just brush my teeth. All right a top now <laughs> um so i got some products off of hsn that we're about to go ahead and open up and use my friend shops on hsn religiously okay religiously and i'm so excited to be partnering with hsn in this video because girl when they reached out i was like okay this is perfect i can ask my friend what should i get on hsn because they're currently having a lot of deals on beauty products so she told me to pick up this clinique all about clean rinse off foaming cleanser and they also have a good deal on their moisture surge which i've used several times in the past but this is just like a little mini size but yeah she told me to try this out so we're about to go ahead and try this out and they have so many other deals on a lot of other beauty products that you guys can check out and it's not just beauty products they have like electronics that you can choose from but yeah she told me to try this out so and it comes like you have two in the box there's two one for now and one for when i run out of this so i'm hoping this is really good i mean she swears by it so we are about to try it out and see you guys already know my obsession with this look at this look at the color you already know so if you've never shot i'm trying to open it so i can get the plastic off because there's oh i thought there was a plastic in it but if you've never shopped on HSN before, they offer a curated assortment of exclusive products. Oh, this is like really moussey. <laughs> um, and it's on a lot of like top brands. So um, I'm just gonna wet my face up a little bit. I'm gonna see what this is. Mm. And spray it's free by the way, which is good. I didn't want anything that's like, you know, heavily scented. But yeah, HSN offers a ton of different products, different brands. I can already tell this is gonna be like really good and gentle. Okay, why is the light going in and out? Okay, there we go. Okay, my skin feels clean. I like that. I like this. Oh, and it's for combination oily to oily skin and I have combo skin. I just get really oily right here on my T-zone. This is nice. Okay, girl. I'm gonna have to thank her for this recommendation because I, I mean, I knew about this cleanser, but I never thought to actually try it out. Okay, I gotta hurry up because I have like 30 minutes to be out of the door. Um, I'm gonna follow up with my other products that I use for my skincare and then we're gonna top it off with the Clinique moisture surge i didn't open it up for y'all let me show you what it looks like cute little mini size perfect for travel you can throw it in your makeup bag one thing i like about this moisturizer because like i said i have used this in the past one thing i like about it is it keeps your skin moisturized the entire day the entire day whether you have makeup on or not um so yeah and you don't need a lot of it either like you just need like a little bit just a little bit but yeah let me put my serum on and then i'm gonna top it off with that moisturizer and then of course put on some spf because we always have to wear spf now if any of you are first time shoppers on hsn i do have a code for you guys where you can get ten dollars off of your purchase i will have it in the description for you guys and just to let you know the deals that they're having they are updated weekly so you want to make sure that you um check those out so you won't miss out on some good deals okay why can i not open it there we go i was like girl i mean you literally don't need much like this is all you need for your face and then i'm just gonna top it off with some sunscreen and then we're gonna run in there and blow dry my hair throw something on 
and head out the door. I actually want to know how many of you shop on HSN. Like, are you a regular shopper? Is this going to be your first time shopping? I want to know. Let's talk about it down below in the comments. All right, skin is nice and moisturized. Now I'm going to pop on some SPF. And we are going to head into the other bathroom so I can blow dry my hair and then head out of the door. So yeah, girl, I'll have the products that I used that I just used in the description so you guys can check those out. And they, like I said, they have a ton of other deals and they update them weekly. So make sure you check that out. And like I said, it's not just beauty products. So if you want to shop for electronics, you know, stuff for your kitchen they have a lot of that stuff on there so all right my skin is nice and prepped for the day and i was actually needing another like gentle cleanser because i was running out of the one that i was using so i am happy about this i came in here because i want to show you guys these eyeliners that you can also get on hsn if you're looking for a new black liner this is from too faced it's a 12 hour smudge resistant killer eyeliner i'll open it so y'all can see it so it's just a cute little eyeliner and it's black really black like really black and really really creamy too wow wow i'm not wearing any makeup today but um i'm definitely going to be using this on my waterline so yeah if you are on the hunt for a new eyeliner a new black liner um and you want to get a you know a good deal on it this is on hsn right now so check that out all right, heading out the door. I just have on this little set from Lululemon and I'm just gonna put on something on my lips because I forgot to do that. Look at my fro, y'all. <laughs> Look at her. She is thriving. She's pretty thick. Um, I ended up just, I didn't even blow dry my hair. I ended up just putting some of this um, deep conditioner in it because I ran out of the one that I've been using, the Audra Beauty, but this one is the Briogeo Superfoods Avocado Leave-In. So I put a little bit of that in my hair and then just um, picked it out. Um, and I feel like it's gonna be like dry by the time I get there. So it's just a tiny bit damp, but it's not like crazy. And I just kind of packed it so it can look more polished. <laughs> Just like that. Y'all, I look just like my mama. Like, I look just like mama. Like this. Mm. And she is looking down on me like, girl, you are my twin. I look just like her with my fur like this. Mm. I miss her so much. Um, okay, so let's go get my hair done. Touch me just Continue on. Use any lane to turn left on the. Okay, this is the place that I'm at getting my Bohemian Knotless braids, so come with me. Okay. Oh, that's cute. I love it. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So, so, like I told you earlier, next time just let us know. I want to ask questions, okay? Okay. Also, me put a room in the shop for the summer. So, we have each style of each baby. Mm -hmm. yeah. That is too cute. I love it. You look like you're going to have a tattoo today, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bye. 
all right guys we got our hair done great customer service they even gave me like a little goodie bag so good so you guys got the information i um about to head to thank you yes they did such a good job good customer service too bohemian knotless it's yeah Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Two people, two people, two people do your hair. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Just take care of me and keep it a long time. All right. Thank you. Bye bye. Woo! I was in there all day, but so worth it. Oh my gosh, y'all! Like this is probably the best I've ever gotten. Ever. Like ever. This is my first time. Well, I told y'all this. My first time getting the Bohemian, Bohemian Knotless. But the customer service in there, superior. Superior. Like, superior. They sit you down. So friendly. They offer you drinks. They offer you snacks. She came around giving everybody snacks. Like, ah, so, 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 so nice. And my little gift that they gave me let's go ahead and go in it i have me some water in there and i went ahead and bought this um bamboo uh, leave-in she said that this was really good and this is what they put on the hair um we got a head scarf we got oh a spray bottle nice oh it already has something in it what's in here I'm pretty sure it's like some conditioner or something, but so sweet. And then this little, um, ooh, headbands. They were so sweet, y'all. Oh my gosh. Um, it's a little pricey, but so I feel like it's so worth it. Like, it's so worth it. And y'all saw me doing my little photo op with her. <laughs> I think she's just gonna, um, cause I usually like, post their work on their Instagram and that's how I discovered this um the salon so yeah let's go what time is it I need to go I need to go I actually need to go pee I should have went to the bathroom in there but let's just go because I'm ready to go I'm hoping this doesn't fall I don't even have it secured with a rubber band or anything. I just put it in a huge bun at the top of my head and I'm just gonna try to secure it with these clips, hoping that it doesn't fall down. Because I'm trying to save it. We leave bright and early in the morning and now I am cleaning and about to pack. I always do this to myself. I literally pack the day before. I leave um but yeah oh yeah it's the next day I got my hair done yesterday it is the next day and now I'm about to clean up pack wash my makeup brushes and I'm just gonna give you guys a little glimpse of what I'm packing my makeup skincare body care um and then my outfits I feel like it's always hard to kind of share or just show the outfits I'm packing because, I don't know, I'll just hold up the clothing pieces that I am packing. But, let's do this. Okay. Thinking I'm going to put all my regular outfits in this cube. And then all of my underwear, bathing suits, and stuff in this cube. If I can fit it. And I like to take like a little dirty clothes bag. So... All of this is from base, by the way. Okay, so it's always hard to show the stuff that I'm packing. So this is a pink stripe set um, that I got from Modern Episode. My, ooh, I'm pretty sure they have an iron there. And we're gonna be in like, more than one hotel so I'm just gonna do this number right here this is my um, 
tip for you if you pack. Roll all your stuff up. Because it's going to save you space. These are the shorts that goes with that top. I have this jumpsuit that looks really, really, really cute with heels. It's a cream jumpsuit. Um, oh, I gotta get, go get the jacket, but look how cute this is together. So this is a squirt, short slash skirt. And I hope this is focusing like, oh, oh this is focusing, yeah. Short skirt. I have the little blazer top to go with it, but how cute is this navy blue and cream with the pink? I think it's cute. I think it's cute. So, yeah, I gotta go get that um, top. Ooh, I hope all of my outfits fit in this. Sometimes I feel like packing without the cubes is easier. Just lay all the stuff flat and lay everything together that goes like each outfit together. But I mean, this does kind of save space. And then this is this outfit. I might even just take this button off because I tried this on when I got back home and the button right here came off. I have it in the other room. I could pack it, but and just pin it. But honestly, you can't really see the button. I mean, it's not noticeable. So I might just go ahead and take that off once I get there. This one right here and just have these two. That's what I might do. But I'm still going to take the button just in case. And I don't know if all of my outfit's going to fit. This is the top to go with it. Blazer. The temperature um, is actually going to be a little cool. It's not going to be like hot. It's not going to be as hot as I thought it was. The high is going to be like in the 60s, 70s, which isn't bad at all. Okay, yeah. I can still fit some more stuff. Um, these shorts. I'm gonna put stuff together that is going to be worn together. I might not even wear this yellow with the blue shorts to be completely honest with you. But I definitely wanna wear the yellow shirt. I just might wear it with something else. Um, black pants, okay. We're making progress. Yeah, we're making progress. The shirt. I'm packing one pair of jeans right here. And I think I'm gonna put those in last. This um, skirt and crop top set. This long flowy dress. Green dress. I have. I thought I had a black dress. Those are bathing suits, cover-ups. I thought I brought my black dress in here too. Let me go get that. Okay. Black dress. Squish it down. Just pretty sure I can get it. Yeah. I can still fit this up. And that's it. Oh, and the jeans. Don't know if this is gonna fit in there. Um for the most part, that's all like for the 
outfits and casual wear. Now let's see if this will zip up. Yes. to go come back home i'm gonna dread putting all the stuff in this one little cube so plan b let's just throw the stuff in here throw it flat this is easier this is how i used to always pack and i personally like packing like that i'm gonna put the other stuff in packing cubes though but like main outfits i personally feel like to me, this is easier. Way, way easier. Okay, I'm gonna put the dresses and stuff together. Casual wear. Together. And plus, the stuff won't be too wrinkled. Ah oh, man, I should have put all of this on this side because this is usually where I put all my bathing suits and stuff. Girl, okay, we're gonna have to do this over. This is why I be don't, don't be doing packing videos. Cause I be messing it up. I got this cover up from Amazon. I got a white one the first time and I loved it so much I had to get me another color. A little pretty blue. I haven't even tried this on that I got from Target. I'm just crossing my fingers that it fits. I'm not even gonna take the tag off. I'm not trying it on right now. My Target cover up. Another Amazon cover up. I'm bringing options, y'all. Probably not even going to wear half of this, but I like to have options. That's why I like to pack everything. My other bathing suits are in the wash. I'll show you the shoes I'm taking in the bag I'm taking. My little coach pillow tabby goes with almost all the outfits that I packed. So I'm taking this. Shoes I'm taking. I have my black Dior pumps. Now these right here go with everything, everything. It even matches the pillow tabby and back that I'm taking, but these are my Zara clear heels and they're so comfortable. So yeah, for the most part, this is what it's looking like. I have so much room to put my um, body care and stuff. I'm gonna put them all in um, different bags. So those are gonna be packed separately, but I'm still gonna put them in this suitcase and the very last thing I'm going to pack in the suitcase is my blanket and my pillowcase. I'm just going to lay it flat on top of that and then buckle this part up. And that'll be it. Let me tell y'all about my look. Y'all know I went to the dentist. Well, if you've been watching my vlogs, you saw that I went to the dentist a few times. Girl, tell me why. I forgot to get some mouthwash. Travel mouthwash, a toothbrush, and toothpaste to take with me. But my dentist packed me a goodie bag, which had all of this in it. And I leave tomorrow. Like, I am not about to go to the store to get anything. I leave tomorrow bright and early in the morning. Girl. All right, I'm going to put it in this bag that 
buy that from Sonia Kashuk. Well, from Target, but it's Sonia Kashuk. So, oral, I could use a smaller bag, but this is all I have for now. Oral hygiene is in here, and then I'm just gonna roll it up. All right, I'm using my new base case. I'm gonna put my skincare at the bottom and then body care at the top if it all can fit in here. So, cleansers, toner. Moisturizer, sunscreen. I have another moisturizer because I'm running out of the pyoma, so I had to get me put that in there. Eye cream, lip mask, makeup remover. Makeup remover right there. Lip mask. There, my face cleansing sponge. And I also wanna just take some of these just for fun. Some face mask, eye patches, and never know, so the Mighty Patch right there. On the top, I'm putting my body care in here. Oh, there's like a cute little zipper and a pocket. Oh, this holds a lot. This holds a lot, y'all. Okay, Luna Daily Feminine Wash. Um, necessary body wash. Actually, let me refill this. some of the okay this is not the same scent i have the necessary sandalwood it's not the same scent but i need to put some more in here i don't know it might smell good together it might smell nice and luxe the sandalwood and eucalyptus it might be a good mixture i don't know I love this little mini body wash bottle. Exfoliating washcloth. And my deodorant. Donna Karen. I've been using this. I just got it at Sephora and I used it already and I love it. So. It is kind of strong though. Um, the scent is kind of strong, but it definitely keeps me dry. So that's all I'm putting in this little thing. All of my, let me double check and make sure. But I think that is literally everything. Yep, that's everything. Also putting my Fenty Body Butter in here too. This is the little small one. And it's gonna fit perfectly right there. I made sure to put everything on the, um, I made sure to put everything right here on the counter so I'll know what to pack, what I'm packing. And that was everything that I had on the counter. This is my packing list for every time I travel. I just check off the things I need. Um, it does switch up depending on where I'm going, but I literally use the same checklist in my phone. Okay, I just washed the brushes that I'm taking. I'm just taking these ones right here. This is gonna be for blush. This is gonna be for my powder. Um, foundation, eyeshadow, but I'm just using bronzer as eyeshadow, and I am taking a little bit of eyeshadow. I'll show y'all that. Um, this is going to be for bronzer and eyes to smudge out the bottom of my eyeliner. This is going to be for my nose contour, um, and this is going to be for the brows for the concealer that I put under. All right, I'm gonna set you guys up right here. We're gonna go through the makeup I'm using. This is the bag that I showed you in my last bog, bog, blog. It's the same makeup case that I already have, but the difference, oh, so the only difference is it has a mirror because I needed a mirror. I did a Sephora haul and I showed all of these products in the haul. So I'm taking everything that I showed in that haul because I kind of want to film a first impression while I'm there. So for the brows, I'm taking my Rim Beauty Concealer. 
I'm going to be um, using, I'm not using foundation, I'm just using concealer and powder. So powder, the MAC Mineralize Skin Finish. The other concealer I'm using is my e.l.f. Camo Concealer. You know what, I'm gonna use the Rim Beauty Concealer for spot concealing too. So for the brows and also for spot concealers, uh, spot concealing since I'm not taking a foundation. Um, I just don't wanna wear foundation. Just a little concealer. I'm gonna do my concealer routine every day. Um, to set the concealer, I'm gonna take the Huda Cherry Blossom in the Sephora translucent powder for bronzer i'm taking my mac bronzer in the shade rich golden i'm also taking my fenty bronzer in the shade coco naughty i still haven't even opened this palette from chanel that i hauled in a video um not too long ago this is the chanel cheek and eye palette so i'm gonna take this look how pretty this thing is girl we're gonna take this um, and try it out. Uh, I might need to take one of these out. I like that you can remove these to make it bigger. And I'm also gonna take my Pat McGrath Single Shadow in the shade Deep Velvet. I like to put this under it's kind of like on my waterline to smoke out the eyeliner mascara i'm taking my elf lash and roll mascara and for the new products i'm gonna try out the nars this is a different shade the nars bronzer laguna number no. six this is the little mini one i ended up trying it in the haul but i still want to use it um pat mcgrath bronzer as well i don't know why i'm taking both of these but i'm still gonna take it this is the new pat mcgrath bronzer in the shade mahogany i'm gonna take that we are going to take the super goop glow screen sunscreen this is a new shade um sunset which is a darker shade yeah let's just put that in like that And the Pat McGrath new mini palette. This is the Sublime Smoke palette. This is the new one. Taking that, putting that right. Oh, that fits perfectly right there. Um, I needed a new brow pencil, the Anastasia Beverly Hills brow pencil in the shade of dark brown. I'm taking my new Ami Cole multi stick. This is in the shade Dune. This is the new Merit Mascara that I want to try out. Kosas Cloud Set Baked Powder in the shade Silky. This is the little mini one that I want to try out as well. And then this Lawless Forget the Filler Plumping Line Smoothing Tinted um, Balm Stick. I got the shade Pink Marshmallow. I'm also taking my new perfume. It's from Net in the shade, why am I saying shade? In the scent Coco Fleur. Coco Fleur. It smells so good. I'm gonna, um, I'm actually gonna put this in something else. Oh, we're also gonna take an eyeliner. I almost forgot to put this in there. This is the Too Faced eyeliner that I showed you guys earlier in the vlog. I'm just gonna take it out because I don't have much room in the makeup case to have it in the case, um, to have it in here. So I'm just gonna take it out and put it in there. Almost forgot this, the Tatcha Dewy Mist, Luminous Dewy Skin Mist. I'm packing this in there as well. I'm gonna put my brushes in something else instead of in there, cause this is already full. And besides the lip products that are in my purse, I'm gonna be taking these right here. My Dior Gloss in the shade 001, Tower 28 Lip Liner, and the Makeup by Mario Lip Colors in the shade Caramel and Soft Nude. All right, I'm keeping my fragrances in this little case right here. I'm gonna show you what's in here. So this is one of my newer fragrances. It's by the, um, the brand is called Mudo. I hope I said that right. And the scent is called Worthy. This is a black owned brand and this smells 
kind of like princess not princess but um um dang what is that killian perfume i have love don't be shy this is a perfume oil so um i like to layer this with the actual perfume that i have but i'm not taking that one i'm just going to take the perfume oil and i'm also going to take y'all know i like to have options my new scent from um why is this not focusing i guess it's because of light in here i don't know but the new net fragrance that i got from sephora coco floor i really don't know why this is the focus is going in and out that's crazy did i hit something on the camera because that's not my camera don't usually do that um and then the other fragrance i'm taking is my burberry her elixir so yeah those are all the fragrances i'm taking and i'm going to spray something different for the airport let me show you i want to smell fresh so i'm going to use my versace bright crystal i haven't worn this in forever and this is a nice clean fresh scent so i'm going to spray this in the morning before going to the airport also putting my fenty body butter in here too this is the little small one and it's going to fit perfectly right there